Hi, in this video we are going to learn about final keyword in Java. So what is final? The final keyword is used to prevent a class from being inherited and to prevent inherited method from being overwritten. Final keyword has a numeric way to use. And final we can use in class method variable. That means a final class cannot be subclassed. A final method cannot be overwritten by subclasses. And a final variable can only be initialized once. So now I execute the final variable in program. So here I already created a class as a scan. In this I go inside the main method I am going to declare a local variable. So I am going to give the data type int i equal to value 90. And next I am going to print this statement. So I am going to give the print statement system.out. Print ln. So inside the double quotes, I'm going to give the variable name i. Now I'm going to change the i value. Now I'm going to give i equal to 80. Now I'm going to run. So in output, it will print 80. Wait and see. Yeah, finally, the output will come as a 80 because it will print the i value changed means i equal to 80. In this, I am going to declare a final variable. So, I am going to give the keyword final. Once we give final keyword means we cannot change the value to the out of program. Now, I am going to change the value i but in final keyword once we can give final keyword we cannot change it will show error so now i am going to give i equal to some value so it will show error because cannot assign a value to final variable i it shows so now i am going to run it will only take the value 90 we can see in this output. This is called final variable. So next time I am going to tell about final method cannot be overwritten by subclasses. In this I am going to, first of all I am going to erase. In this I am going to give another two classes. Class name as a A. And another class name as a b. Inside this, I'm going to give the method name. So void. I'm going to give the method name as a show. So inside the b class, I'm going to give the same method o show. So here I am going to print the statement system dot out dot print ln inside the double quotes hello weld so in this I am going to use the keyword and I am going to call the class A extends a so in this it will override the method show we can see add override annotation so now I am going to run so it will print the class b hello world because it will override it so once again I am going to run Before that, I am going to create an object for class B. So, B equal to object equal to new class name as a B. In this extend keyword, we can access both subclass and parent class. When we give final, it cannot be override. So, now I am going to 
give object dot method name show now I am going to run it will execute the class B hello world executed now I am going to give the final keyword in this method since one we can give final variable keyword means it does not print this override because it will show error we can see cannot be overrided override and method is in final so this is called final variable so next time I'm going to tell about class final class so first of all I'm going to erase In this we have two class now it will inherit it in class A so final class we cannot inherit it. now I'm going to declare as a final as a class A so it will show error because we cannot inherit the final keyword in class it shows cannot inherit us from final A so this is called final class so in this video we learn about final keyword in java so thanks for watching this video